can this engine go? Here we go. Chicka, 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 chicka. Well, it probably shouldn't go... Uh, that fast. Oops. Uh, Fox, want to turn? Gee, thanks, Franklin. Come on, guys. Okay. Chugga, 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 chugga. Uh-oh. I think it's broken. It's not broken. I just have to make it fit on the tracks. Like this. Got it. Huh. Awesome! Yeah. Cool! Whoa. Great! Now that's how you operate a train. Mm -hmm. Hi, Mr. Mole. Hello, Mr. Mole. Hi, Mr. Turtle. Hello, boys. Franklin, Mr. Mole had an extra switcher he thought you might huh? want to use. Would I? Thanks. Now, do you know what the switcher does? Sure do. You put it in the tracks so the train can change directions. If I point the switcher right, the engine goes right. Cool. Neat. <laughs> but if I point it left, the locomotive goes that way. Right you are. I'm impressed, Franklin. Wow, thanks, Mr. Mole. You have the best train set in town. Your train set is our town. Yeah, it looks just like it. Not too much anymore. I've been so busy, I can't keep up with all the changes. But if some young train enthusiasts with good eyes were to help me... Oh, hey. oh yes! Oh, yes. yes. <laughs> I hope there's enough train for all these volunteers. Chugga-chugga-chugga! <laughs> <laughs> woo, woo. Uh-oh! Not again! Ah! Oh, no! Whoa! Rabbit, go more slowly into the curve. When you go too fast, the train leans over and it can fall off the track. Okay, slowing down. That's it, you did it. <laughs> hey, it worked. <laughs> Good job. Hmm. Mr. Mole, I think the car hooking thingy might be broken. Oh, not the car hooking thingy, Fox. That's called- The coupler. That's exactly right, Franklin. Wow, Franklin. How'd you learn so much about model trains? I have this Coolio book on trains. I've read the whole thing four times. <laughs> you know, I caught the train bug when I was just about your age. In fact, I got this little engine for my seventh birthday. Wow, and it still gets around? Uh-huh. I snapped some photos of the town so we can check them against my model. Uh, okay. Hmm. Look, your little library is a different color from the real one. Very observant. We'll just have to repaint it to make it match. Okay. Hey, the messy make it shop doesn't look like that little building. This picture's not right either. Well, I took it a few months ago before your aunt moved back to Woodland. Isn't Aunt T store yellow? No, nope, it's blue. Nuh uh. Definitely brown. Let's find out. Our job is to help Mr. Mole make everything match. The color checker is on his way. <laughs> <laughs> Woohoo! Woohoo! <laughs> ha! Brown! I was right! Yes! And blue. Franklin's right. And yellow. Fox is right, too. And orange, red, and green. Is there any color that's not here? Weird. This statue looks just like Aunt Turtle. She is a really, really good artist. Oh, thanks. Ah! <laughs> Whoa, Aunt T. <laughs> Rabbit, I'm not a statue of me. I am me. But why were you standing so still? Oh. <laughs> I wasn't. I was taking a Tai Chi break. It's an exercise where you move very, very slowly. <laughs> Move slowly? That's a funny way to exercise. Well, why don't you try it? Here, I'll show you. First, move your arm very slowly this way. Like this? Yeah, yeah, now this way. You know who would be really good at this? Snail. But he'd have to do the arm stuff with his antenna. We could call it Snail Chi. You know, uh, with Tai Chi, you kind of need to be quiet, too. I can be super duper quiet. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. 
Mmm. Much better. Now the library's color matches the pictures. <laughs> Yellow! Look, Fox. If you glue some lichen to a toothpick... Like this... You'll make a tiny tree. Give it a try. I did it. Franklin, you really do know a lot about model trains. Franklin, would you like to repaint this little park bench? Sure, that'd be great. And I'm going to make a really big tiny tree. Careful, Fox. Uh, 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 <gasps> oh, no. <laughs> Sorry. No worries. Sneezes happen. And that one happened all over my spectacles. It got on the train station, too. Sorry again. Well, the station needed a touch-up anyway. But I'd better clean my specs first. Carry on. <laughs> Whoa. There's a gazillion little pieces. This is going to take a while. Hmm. Hey. I know. Can we vacuum the tracks? Um... Well, uh... Don't you uh, know? Or should we go ask Mr. Mole? No, I know about model trains. And vacuuming the tracks is okay. Because why else would Mr. Mole keep a vacuum close to the tracks? Right. Hey, it works! I mean, of course it works. I knew it would. <laughs> hey, guys! Guess what? Guess what? Guess what? I'm Tai chi Huh? And Turtle showed me how. Oh, and her shop is yellow. I knew it. We all knew it. It's also brown and blue and red and other colors that I can't remember. <gasps> Carrot sticks. I'd better go check again. <laughs> oh, rabbit. Um, where's the tiny conductor guy? I think we vacuumed him up. Should we tell Mr. Mole? No. He might think I don't know what I'm... I mean, we don't need to bother, Mr. Mole. I can get it out. What if we open this little door? <coughs> <coughs> Ugh, got it! <coughs> Goodness gracious! <laughs> uh... I clean these glasses, but they're so foggy I feel like I'm standing in a giant cloud. Better clean them again. Phew. But what are we going to do with all this dust? Hmm. Hmm. Yellow all over, blue in a line, paint drips into a butterfly sign. Hey, back again, you little whippersnapper? Yep. With so much running, I bet you're hungry, huh? Sure am. How about a crunchy apple fresh from this tree, huh? Uh-oh. There's no teeny tiny apple tree next to your teeny tiny shop. I better go tell them. Bye. See you later. Hmm. What a mess. <sighs> Maybe it's time we ask for Mr. Mole's help. But Franklin, it's like you said. We can figure this out. I have an idea. We can dust the tracks really fast. <sighs> it's kind of working. Oh, no. There was paint on this brush, and now it's on the tracks. Oops. Maybe I can wipe it off. That only smeared it more. What'll Mr. Mole think when he sees this? Hmm. Hold on, hold on, hold on, emergency! What's wrong, Rabbit? There are apples on Aunt T's tree, but there are no apples on this tree. Look, Rabbit, we kind of have a real emergency now. I can handle this. Just need a little red paint. Whoa! Oh, no! no! <sighs> Got it. <gasps> <gasps> oh, no! Uh. <gasps> uh. Oh. Oh. <sighs> Good heavens! What happened? Mr. Mole, I'm super sorry. I wanted to show off by doing it on my own, but I can't. I should have asked for your help. It's my fault, too. Mine three. But we'll do our best to help fix this, if that's okay with you. I've had this locomotive since I was seven. Oh, gee, Mr. Mole, I, I mean... And it's not the first time it broke. <laughs> <gasps>
You fixed it. Yeah. A little paint thinner will clean up those tracks in no time. Part of the fun of model railroading is putting it all together. As long as you know when to ask for help. <laughs> <laughs> hey, choo-choo guys. You need any help painting? Sure. I've been told I'm a pretty good artist. Of course. In fact, would you mind painting the replica of your shop? Oh, it's so little and cute. I bet it would look precious in pink. No, it's blue. Uh-uh. Brown. Yellow. Nope. Uh-huh. Uh -uh. Here we go again. Uh-uh. <laughs> Ready? <laughs> Here we go. Abracadabra, alacadero, make this hockey card disappear -o. Ooh! <gasps> Where'd the card go? <laughs> right here, behind your ear. Wow, you really can do magic. <laughs> it's just a trick, Goose. The card was in the handkerchief the whole time. Whoa, you just learned to do that? Uh-huh. Bear and I just learned all the tricks we're going to be doing. Out of my amazing magician's book of fabulous magic tricks. Pretty good, huh? Good? Amazing! I hope our moms like it. A Mother's Day magic show for all of our moms. It's going to be the best ever. Yay! <laughs> okay, we don't have much time till our moms get here for the show, so we'd better teach you what to do, Goose. Leap! Uh, jete! Goose? Jete! Jete! Tourne! Tourne! Uh, what are you jete. doing, Goose? Seeing if I can remember. Remember what? How to do that amazing jump I learned at ballet class. Oh, maybe we could do some ballet in the magic show. What do you think? Um, well, maybe. But let's learn the magic tricks first, okay? Okay. We don't have much time. The moms will be here soon. Oh. Okay. Look, tricks Daddy. first. Franklin made a sailboat. Uh-oh. Huh? Oh, no. <laughs> no, Harriet. That's not a sailboat. That's the curtain for Franklin's Mother's Day magic show. <sighs> it's just Dad and Harriet. Woo! Where's Mom? She and Dr. Bear have gone to get their nails done as a Mother's Day treat and won't be back till after lunch. Good. We don't want her to see the surprise show. Yeah. Do you mind if Harriet plays here and watches while I fix the leak under the sink? Can I? I'll be really quiet, and so will Lily Kitty. Um... Okay, but you can't tell how we do the tricks, okay, Harriet? It's a surprise. I promise. <laughs> okay, Goose, you're the magic assistant. You mean the talented magic assistant. <laughs> okay, the talented magic assistant. Sorry. So you get to open the curtain. Yay! Just pull this cord. Ha, huh. easy peasy. Great, I knew we could depend on you, Goose. This is gonna be great. Okay, let's practice the start of the show. You say our names and then open the curtain. Um, what are your magician names again? Franklin the Fabulous. And the Amazing Bear. <laughs> okay, here goes. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to our Mother's Day magic show. Magic show! Now, here they are, Franklin the Fabulous and the Amazing Bear. Yay! Woo! Woo! Oops. We're all right. <laughs> Sorry, sometimes I slip. It's okay. It wasn't your fault, Goose. Maybe we should come in from the sides. Good idea, Bear. Oh, then what do I do? Well, you can still say our names and then help us with the magic tricks. Ooh, good. Yes! Okay, Goose. In this trick, I'm going to cut a string in half and then magically fix it. Really? That sounds great. What do you need me to do? You just hand bear this straw and then this string. Okay, let's try. Okay. <clears throat> and now, ladies and gentlemen, I will do a very amazing trick. Please, assistant. You mean talented assistant. Um, yeah. Talented assistant. Please give me the straw. You got an amazing bear. Ta-da! Uh, oops. <gasps> Whoops! Hey! Get back here! I oh! Almost got it! Whoa! Oh, over there, Goose! No, not behind you! You almost got it! Huh? <laughs> Woo! Here you go, amazing bear! The straw. Uh thank you, talented assistant. See? Just a normal straw. 
Now please hand me the string, talented assistant. Oh yeah, <laughs> the string. <laughs> what? Okay. Um, wait. Oh, come on, get back. Oh, no. Almost got it. Now how did that happen? Well, oh. that was a good try. Tell you what, let's practice that some more and you'll be awesome. Okay, let's do it again. Oh, but we should practice the next trick first. You'll love this one, Goose. But I haven't gotten... Just wait till you see it. <laughs> Ooh. This is a really great trick, Goose. The penny through hand trick. It's my favorite. Are you really gonna push a penny through your hand? <laughs> I hope so. Watch. Alakazam, alakapop. Go from the bottom to the top. Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> oh my, very good. All right. I know how it works. Wow, that was good. How did you? <laughs> Easy. I just shake my hand like this, and when the penny pops out, I push it to the top with my other hand. Tricky. And my job is to bring you the coin, right? Right. Hey, maybe this is where I can do my ballet leap. I can leap on and hand you the coin. Uh, yeah, good idea. Great. Oh, no! Oops! My penny! Whoopsie! Don't worry, I'll get you another one. Keep practicing. Okay, Dad. Oh, maybe I'm just not good at magic. Uh, sure you are, Goose. Yeah, it was just an accident. But maybe you could do something easier for that trick. Like... Like... Point to the penny. That's an important job, too, you know. Hey, yeah. Oh, okay. Hey, maybe I could leap while I point. You know what we need? One really big trick for the end of the show. Yeah, a really great trick that'll make her moms really clap. Whoa, look at this one. This is it. The disappearing guy trick. Is it hard to do? I don't think so. Let's try it, okay? I'll make you disappear. Awesome. And Goose, why don't you... I'll just sit here with Harriet. I don't want to wreck the big trick. Um, are you sure? Yeah. Come on, Franklin. The moms will be here soon, and we have to practice this trick. Uh, coming bear. Silly magic show. Ballet's way more fun. <gasps> you know ballet? Show me! Okay. Yay! Bear, it's not working. Huh? You have to do it fast, or the audience will know you didn't really disappear. Let's try it again. <clears throat> Bear beside me, standing near. Bear beside me, disappear! Ha! Oh, oh brother. I can't get to the hiding place fast enough. You try it. Okay. Da 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 da. Dante, Dante, tippy tippy. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Ready, Franklin? Okay, ready. Let's go. Turtle beside me, standing near. Turtle beside me, disappear! Ta-da! <sighs> Gee, I'm not fast enough either. You need to be really good at jumping to do this trick. Maybe we <laughs> should do something else. Sete, sete. Please, do it again, <laughs> No, we need a really coolio trick for the end bear. This will be great. Come on, let's try it again. But the moms are coming really soon. I know! Where are we gonna find a good jumper before they- Ta-da! Huh? Goose! Goose, you're a super jumper. I know. I've been telling you that all morning. You have? Oh, ballet. Gee, I'm sorry, Goose. I guess we were paying attention to our tricks and not you. Yeah, but now we need a good jumper, Goose, for the big disappearing trick at the end of the show. Would you give it a try, Goose? But I'm not good at magic. But this is jumping magic. Ooh, I bet I could do that. And you could do jumping magic for the other tricks, too, if you want. I'd love to! Yay! My pretty ballet! Let's get practicing. This is going to be great! Yeah! Happy Mother's Day. My, don't you two look nice. <laughs> Why, thank you. And so do you. <laughs> this is turning into a perfect Mother's Day. Very nice. I know how they do the tricks. But I can't tell you. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, quiet, everyone. I think they're about to start. Oh, yeah. Shh. Okay. <clears throat> Moms and everybody else, welcome to the Mother's Day Magic Yay! Show. <laughs> <laughs> Woohoo! Yeah! 
I give you Franklin the Fabulous and the Amazing Bear. Ta-da! <laughs> Abracadabra, Alacadero, make this hockey card disappear! Oh! <laughs> wow! Thanks! Turtle smiles and feathers of geese, string I've cut, be in one piece! Oh. <laughs> Ready? Beside us, standing near, goose beside us, disappear! Yay! How did they do that? I guess there's a mother here who'd like to have goose back for Mother's Day, am I right? <laughs> yes, please. <laughs> well, that's easy. <laughs> that's why we're called Franklin the Fabulous! And the Amazing Bear! And the Talented Goose! <laughs> <laughs> Let's try it again. Here we go. Ta da! Hooray! Woohoo! Thank you, thank you, mercy. Oops. Oops. <laughs> <laughs>